to be eight years since the abduction of 276 school girls, 109 of them remain missing. And abductions keep going on every day and kidnaps. And there's more insecurity today than it was eight years ago. Yes, we are in contact with the, with the parents and they don't know what is going on either. The government does not speak to them, does not address them, does not answer any of their concerns. It only gives issues out, people's statements on the 14th of April every year and goes to sleep till the 14th of April the next year. And that's all. I feel very frustrated. And, and disappointed and, and angry at the same time. Nobody anticipated that eight years on, we'll still be talking about the same thing. Remember that when the abduction happened, it was something that it was possible to have rescued them within a week, within days, but the government then was, was um, dragging its feet and deceiving itself and deceiving others. And the thing kept going on. And then the, that government left and a new one came and came with a, a bundle of incompetence like my colleague spoke earlier. Um, the person you spoke to earlier said, a bundle of incompetence, worse than the last um, regime. And so that is from being one bumbling start to the other. Yeah, yeah, we give kudos to them because within this time, 100 and 110 have come back from 2016 to now, which is something because before then, not one was came back and we also fertilized the idea that there was no such thing as cheaper girls and there was no uh, abduction or so, but we have 110 of them back and 109 remain missing today, including others that were abducted in the process, like Leah Sharibu and others who are still in captivity. Please do subscribe to our YouTube channel and don't forget to hit the notification button so you get notified about fresh news updates.